Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Alex's Afternoon Art Show. Today we are doing Colossus as part of the Marvel vs. Capcom 2 mural. So this is going to be a character that could very well take a long time because I'm going to have to do a lot of rendering to sell the shininess of his skin. And yes, I am for some reason still doing the bizarrely over-enthusiastic intro. I could not tell you why. Because uh, the rest of the video certainly won't be like that, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> The energy will rapidly drain as uh, as this goes on for another two or three hours of me in mostly silence. <laughs> Anyways, roll the intro and we'll get on with it then. <laughs> this again and I'm beginning to feel like it might be might be worth doing something with this area. I don't know, I feel like maybe I should add a base or something. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Because yeah, this area feels very bare as compared to the, the Marvel area over there. The Marvel area is very busy at this point. Uh, but yeah the Capcom area rather empty at this at this point in things things aren't really there's no big characters after this point all the big characters are right at the start of the Capcom side and all the big characters of the Marvel side are all at the very end so it's kind of not spread very evenly so I might think about it we'll see we'll see how we uh, how we decide to do things in the future so this is the point where I need to start removing these characters yeah, I think I might need to reorganize this a little bit as well. Uh, but you should be able to already see that, yeah, uh, Colossus is at the uh, at the front there. So, um, yeah, so this is the thing. He'll be covering some of Juggernaut whenever whenever he's done. Uh, we're getting a little bit of lag on, on this. I did clear some space off the computer, so this should run a little better. Uh, and any potential moderate frame rate issues that were in the previous videos shouldn't be there this time because like I said I did remove those things um, but yeah obviously Colossus isn't as big as Juggernaut or the Hulk I think he's the median size of both of them because Hulk is this big and Juggernaut is bigger than the Hulk and then yeah Colossus is only slightly smaller than the Hulk but it's just because he's lower on the page, so because uh, you have to do this in in waves within reason, uh, in order to keep the kind of packedness of the uh, of the of the, the mural. But yeah, so yeah, uh, Juggernaut is I think the biggest. Actually, no, Anacharis is the biggest character. I think he'll remain the. Or no, uh, whenever we get to the Sentinel, he's the biggest character. The Sentinel was the biggest character, um, but yeah, Juggernaut is the second biggest, then uh, then Hulk, then Colossus, I believe. Or yeah, Sentinel, Anacharis, Juggernaut, and then down the way that we were going. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, I might need to actually do a tiny bit of work on some of this because some of it looks a bit weird. I feel like this doesn't cover enough area. I should open my reference. Uh, yeah. See, it's definitely the shoulders I think need to be bigger. The shoulders need to come out more. Because um, the shoulders are quite pointy in, uh, in the game. And yeah, yeah, in the game, Juggernaut is bigger than Hulk. Because I'm seeing a picture of it here in my reference. That Juggernaut is bigger than Hulk. And then Colossus is slightly smaller than Hulk. Um, yeah, but obviously Hulk is much broader than Jugger or than uh, than uh, Colossus. So yeah, Colossus is slightly more human-sized in terms of musculature. Juggernaut is the most obscene, uh, obscenely muscular character, with Hulk being a little bit behind that. Because uh, for those of you that don't know, the Hulk in the the Marvel vs. Capcom games up until Marvel vs. Capcom 3 is supposed to be the Professor, so uh, he's supposed to be the Smart Hulk. So that's just your little bit of trivia. But yeah, I think I will start getting things ready here. 
Oh yeah, they can get rid of a lot of the reference. Uh, I suppose just for the the fun of it, um, the the model that I used for Colossus was nude. So um, yeah, you're getting slightly more realistic body proportions here, I think. Uh, and again, that's because it was a nude model that I used. Um, but yeah. Um, what else was I gonna say? I was gonna say something else, but I'm forgetting what I was gonna say now. Um, I think I think that's all I really need to mention. Uh, I'm gonna need to move some of this stuff over, maybe make the shoulder pads a little bigger, and then yeah, yeah. I think most of the rest of it is fine. Uh, his hair. I think I might. Yeah, I might do something else with his hair because originally my intention was that the hair would be just fully black, uh, but I don't think I need to do that. I think I might do something else for that. But we will see. Uh, we'll see, anyways. So, uh, yeah, I will begin. Okay, I had a little bit of a, a, a time skip there, so um, yeah, I finished the details mostly, not entirely finished. It got very dark all of a sudden, so I had to turn on the light, but yeah, so the thing that we have to do is I have to render out the shiny bits, which is going to take a minute, and I also forgot to do the lines on his fingers, so um, yeah, so doing the shiny bits is going to take a minute. Um, and yeah, basically I just did this little, in, uh, inter, chose to interject here because it, it again, will probably take a minute. So, uh, just to, to preface that, and um, yeah, what was I going to say? Um, yeah, the hands look a little bit weird, I think, but I don't know really what I can do about that right now. I think I'll probably just leave them because I don't know what else to do with them. Um, but yeah, these weird little bracer things aren't all that usual looking. So anyways, anyways, uh, enough rambling. I think I will just, yeah, as I say, just very quickly do... Why isn't it working? Uh, just very quickly do the... Uh, oh my god, my brain today is so bad. Um, I will just try and very quickly get through the, yeah, the, the little bit of rendering I have to do to sell the shiny effect. And um, yeah, do to finish off his fingers as well. But yeah, uh, I will uh, return whenever I'm doing the dots.
Okay, so that is our details fully done. That includes our rendering of, um, oh, excuse me. That includes our rendering of all the, the shiny, um, of all the shiny metallic bits. Um, uh, and yeah. So, oh, my eyes are getting tired now. But um, yeah, so now that that is done, it is time to do the dots. Um, which will probably take a minute. Um, I'm gonna need to remember which side I need to put this stuff on. Um, cause where's Juggernaut? Juggernaut's there, and his is on the right. Okay, so I will do these knots, and then I will be back. Okay, so that's our dots, which means now we're doing the colors, uh, which should be pretty quick. Because, uh, I mean, well, I mean, technically, yeah, the skin is going to be silver, so that is, uh, yeah, going to take a second, but the rest of it will probably be reasonably quick. Um, yeah, I can't see this taking a huge amount of time because there's only three colors going on here. Well, you see, this is the thing. In a lot of the art, his eyes are yellow. I don't know why. Because uh, as far as I always understood it, his eyes were also silver. His eyes would also go silver. So I don't know how that works. Um, but yeah, his hair is going to need to be a different color anyways. Um... But yeah, I'll make it a very kind of lightish silvery color uh, and make it more of this kind of a blue and then maybe make it slightly bluer, slightly more silvery and that should work. We'll see. We'll see how it looks, but I will be back once these colors are done. So, yeah. Okay, there's our colors done, um, nice and quick. And yeah, so this is the beauty of, uh, of Colossus's design. Very simple, uh, and it pops off the page. So that's the, the beauty of it. But uh, yeah, next thing on the list, I don't need to name that. Uh, next thing on the list is... Cheating. My brain, my brain today is not having it. Uh, it's not working with me, but yeah, this is my 132nd uh, unnamed layer. So that's uh, that's that's a lot. That's a lot of unnamed layers. Um, yeah, it, it is amazing how long this is. <coughs> excuse me, how long this has gone on for? Because uh, I mean, I'm, by that I mean the the series, not this particular episode. But yeah, it is, it is amazing how long this has gone on for because, yeah, I didn't anticipate, even though I knew exactly how many episodes it was going to be, somehow I didn't anticipate the actual length of doing it. Because realistically speaking, I could have gotten all this done in like a month or two. An active project of like a month or two if I wanted. But because of the nature of doing these as videos, that means I only do one every couple of days or I do a few in a row in, in terms of days and stuff like this but I don't do them all that often 
Uh, and then sometimes there's gaps of like a month or something where I don't do any of them, but they're obviously still coming out, so I don't have to do them. So this is the thing that happens. So it's it's, it's funny to think about, I suppose. But uh, yeah, I may as well start doing this shading and then I'll be back to do the light line and that will be us. So anyways. Okay, so that is our shading done. Oh, there was my chest popping, by the way. Um, yeah, there was our shading done. So now we have to do the light line, which should be uh, might be quick, might be might take a few minutes because I do have to sell the shininess even more still. Because as uh, as you'll probably have noticed, the uh, a lot of those lines get hidden whenever the you know, whenever the shading goes on, so it can disappear a little bit but anyways i will do the light line and then that will be us so okay so that is our light line done, which means that is us done. Um, yeah. So that is, yeah, that is Colossus. Which means, yeah, we're done. Oh my god. Ugh, I'm tired from that. But yeah, so he definitely still pops even on the white background, which is nice. And yeah, he's, he's a lot bigger than some of the other characters, but he's still pretty small, all things considered. So now it's time to turn on all the other characters and see how he stacks up. Now he is going to be quite a bit further forward than some of the others, which is worth noting, because yeah, he's still quite a he's I think one of the furthest forward characters. But again, this has to move up and down in layers like that. It's the only way to keep the kind of keep the bulk going. That's what I said right at the start, I think. But yeah, it's the only way to kind of keep the the bulk controlled, so to speak. Um. But yeah, so next time, who are we doing? Next time, because that was Colossus. Yeah, next time, I believe we are doing M. Bison. I might be wrong. I'm going to have to confer with my brain here for a second because it's M. Bison. Okay. Yeah, no, yeah, no, I think M. Bison is our next one, because M. Bison goes with Blackheart, and then, and yeah, he's there, and then Sabretooth. So, yeah, I do think next is M. Bison. So, yeah, you can look forward to that, I suppose, next week, but, uh, yeah, so, ah, uh, yeah. I, I do get tired after these, so you'll forgive me if my brain is uh, definitely not as functional as it once was, uh, namely during the intro whenever I had uh, that moment of energy, which I even said would be fleeting. But anyways, uh, I suppose I will sign off, and that will be us. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I will sign off. So, I'll do my outro. Um, yeah, if you like the video, do what you normally do, whether it be liking it or whatever it is that you would normally do. Again, I would prefer if you liked it, but I mean, if you don't want to do that, that's fine. Um, same deal if you want to subscribe, go for it. The button is there, you know where it is. Um, but if you don't want to do that, that's fine. Carry on with your life. <laughs> uh, but yeah, and uh, yeah, if you decide to watch the next video, I will see you next time. So, um, with all that said, I will say goodbye, and that will be us. So, uh, yeah.
Bye-bye.